we were, me and my mouse Paia, hard at work on the grand finale of my seventh Hollywood script. The first six were returned by every agent in the business with a polite note attached, like get a job at McDonald's. But this script was different. I've been at it for over a year, storing on the hard drive a melting pot of true stories that I had seen and experienced in my last 12 years sailing through this weird culture called Maui. And then, just as I completed the last line, a chill wind blew through the door. Hey, how's it going, Jonathan? Hi, Eric. How's the script look? Pretty good. I'm on my final scene. Finally, right on. By the way, did you uh, see this article in the paper about this computer virus called Michelangelo? Wiping out programs save all it, save over. It. I'm almost done here, okay? Oh, okay. Save it. Go ahead. No. What's going on here? Oh, no. Where are the words oh, going? It? It's crashing. What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? Stop it! It's crashing! <laughs> Why me? 120 pages down the drain. What kind of disease did this Leonardo have anyway? Not Leonardo. Michelangelo. It's a computer virus. Leonardo, Michelangelo, what's the difference? Maybe this is a sign to throw in the towel. Get a real job cleaning tuna at the fish bucket. Well, nobody was going to buy that script anyway. Forget Hollywood. Let's just do it ourselves. We're talking a barefoot budget here. What will we make it with? Peanut butter and jelly? Why not? You run the camera, I'll do the sound. Oh yeah, oh yeah. So, how we pay for the actors? We gotta have actors. Let's just grab a couple of nuts off the beach and wing it. You gotta start somewhere. It'll be the new rough and raunchy style. Look at MTV. You got a point there. Who needs a script anyway? Just tell it like it is. Let it fly. Okay, okay. What have we got to lose? Go something like this. Somewhere deep in the foothills of Squamish, Canada. Our boy Jazz is taking a break from his pig farming duties to dream his little dream about making it from the pig time to the big time. Stuck in the mud of reality, all he can think about is fulfilling his lifelong fantasy of becoming a windsurfing superstar. Will you see this? This is Robbie Nash, man. This is where I'm going. This is where the big show is, in Hawaii's North Shore. I wish I could take you with me. There's just not a plane big enough to fit you on. You're going to have to stay here and look after things for me. Do you hear me? You're gonna have to stay here. Yes! Uh, yeah. This is where I'm going, man. The grand finale. The place of all places.
Mukipan. Now, if Jazz is consumed with the idea of going to Maui, Cisco, soon to be sidekick, is downright obsessed. Cisco! Cisco, why don't you tell the rest of your Harvard classmates here the theories of trickle down economics? Cisco! Yeah! Tell the rest of your Harvard classmates what trickle down economics is. Um, uh, Trickling the money out of the taxpayer pockets or something? <laughs> Listen, Cisco, just because you came from Argentina with a silver spoon in your mouth doesn't mean we're going to feed you that way. I want a 30-page report on trickle-down economics on my desk by Monday. Got it? Shape up or ship out. Just like two colliding atoms, Jackie. our dynamic duo arrive on Maui at the same cosmic moment. Molecules of madness soon to mash in their search of windsurfing paradise, and a fine set of wheels to get them there. Call it luck of the draw, they both Jackie. arrive same time, same station, at Total Rec used cars. No way, man, this thing legal? Hey, you bet, and the price is right, 750 bucks. You not a dime more for the rough, I hope. <laughs> and I'll throw in the stickers. Hey, I got another 50 bucks? No way. Yes way. I'm telling you, this is a genuine Maui cruiser. This thing's a collector's item. There's very few of these left on the road today. If you want to try this in the kitchen around town, there's no better gas pods than what this thing will give you. Well, you see, this sort of fits my image. So I'll tell you what I'll do. I'll give you $600 for it. And that's it. Come on. Hey, hey, hold on. That's it. Come on here. Right now, I have... $650. Wait, wait, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Can you excuse us for a second? Hey, come. listen, buddy, all right? There's no way we are going to pay this guy that much for this piece of junk. Let's talk, all right? I've come here to Windsor, not pick pineapples for car payments. Hey, me too, man. You any good? Oh, yeah. Okay. Really? Mm -hmm. I'm going to keep the first day, man. That's where the big show is, the big time, the big action. <laughs> Boom. Mokipa? Yeah. Um, well, I guess if you go, I go, man. Right on, man. Tell you what, we'll go hackers on the car. Let's deal with the man. Yeah. You pay now, I'll pay you later. Come on. Okay. All right, what'd you come up with? $600, not a penny more. Take it, leave it. Cash right now, the car's yours. Give him the keys, we're done. I'll pay you later. Remember two things. Final. There's no guarantee. Go no, back! Never sleep. sleep. A unique blend of chemistry these guys were. Cool breeze and hot water. Certain to be friends for life. Now that they had met, Silver Cisco and Brassy Jazz could share everything they had in common on their way to rent some gear at the most prestigious shop in the island. High Tech Surf Sports. Hey man, what's the smell? Jesus! I don't smell anything. It smells like the farm back home in Squamish. Oh. Everything smells like this back there. You guys ever take a bath over there? Oh, you're such a spoiled little city slicker. Yes. Boy, I'll bet you take showers in Grey Poupon back home. Well, at least I got no Grey Poop in my shoes, man. All right, we come from different worlds. So what? Yeah. Whoa, what's that, man? Hey, how can I help you guys? Oh, I have papaya. Hi, my name is Jazz. This is my good friend, hey, the Cisco Kid. All right, what's happening? What can I do for you guys? Personally, I'm looking for a sponsor. Sponsor? Yeah, hey, man. sure, we'll spot you. Bill, what's a blue light special today? Sponsorship this week? How about keychains and watch bands? 15% off. Sounds great. Let's wrap it up and go. There was only one thing on Cisco and Jazz's mind. 
make it to Ho Keepa. All right. Thanks a lot, huh? That's all set. Yay, yeah, cool. All right. Okay, yeah, uh, yeah. you guys a map of Tanaha? Uh, no, no, no. We're no. okay. We're okay. Just down the road here. Yeah. 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 yeah, sure. Yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah
was lunchtime, a fine time for Cisco and Jazz to dine elegantly between the hammer and the anvil, the fists and the bone of the impact zone. The question is, would they be eaten with a fork or eaten with a spoon? As all newcomers are welcome to any sport, who keep a local sailors rolled out the red carpet for our two rookies. Where they soon learn cool rule number three. There's only one thing you gotta remember when you're on my wave. My wave! Get off it! Oh, oh. We go to Ganaha. There is no way I'm sailing here. Oh no, man, no. we'll just stay here. These rocks will become our second home. You just watch, wait, and see. What do you oh, say, Mom? I'm talking. Sailing. Just down the road from Hokipa is the funky little town of Paia, where the windsurfers live just to be a little closer to the wind and the sea. Palm trees bending, hippies transcending, Paia is the place. Looking for something? Yeah. Cheap place for rent. For you two, I know the perfect place. It's a tropical setting. 500 bucks a month. <clears throat> Pets included. It's very quaint. It's right over here. Let's see you, man. Hey, Jess. What's quaint mean? I think it's wine from Shack. Paradise. Welcome to reality. My dream home. Welcome to your new pad, boys. Home sweet home. Nice neighbors. <laughs> Our dynamic duo retreat to Spreckelsville where the waves are on the tame side, but the wind is blowing steady clean trades from the northeast, whipping up the water with a fury. Nicknamed Spreckenseville, Spreckel Slovakia are just plain Euro Beach. For its international crowd, Spreckelsville is a melting pot of sailing cultures. Bonjour, bonichiwa, good morning.
Just to get up yeah. that hill. I guess hey, like man. What did you get us, you crazy Mexican? Yeah, Three fried beans? Ice cream beans? and beers. And, uh, I don't know, something here and there. Cool. Yeah. Ice cream and beers will make Sundays. Yeah. Breakfast of champions. Oh, We're going to go. shred now. Ah, Moosehead, something of my Canadian heritage. What a man. Ah, cookies. So where should we sail today? <laughs> oh. Now the ice cream. Did I tell you it was a classic or what, huh? In Canada, we use Southern Comfort. Mm. Oh, man. I don't know if I like that. Ah, uh, yeah, it's nice. Oh. Every Christmas. You know, put the chocolate. Mm. Oh, yeah. Nice. Mm. Mm. Let the chocolate, you know, float there. Oh, <laughs> <fuck>. <laughs> <laughs> now, not everyone on Maui is goon with the wind. Some take their sport very seriously, like Flash here, the champion from Germany. hard, eats right, sleeps in a house at night. His whole life revolves around getting his body in shape for competition. And when he's not sailing, swimming laps, or stretching his lats, he's cashing in on endorsements. What's good enough for the babe is good enough for me. Eat your sweeties. Now, there are a lot of professional sailors here on Maui, and Jazz and Cisco were feeling a bit jumped out. So they ripped some stickers off their car and stuck them all over their sails. Jazz, for all he was worth, was suddenly sponsored by big international companies like iFly and Windsurfing Kimsei, while Cisco went for the local The Kind sticker and put some numbers on his sail to look like a true pro. Now all they had to do was learn how to act like one. 4.7 be okay? Oh, I don't know, Gomer. Why don't we just try what we got and go give it a try, huh? Uh, Let's go, know. everyone! Looks like four to six in the house, man.
It's obvious that Jazz and Cisco, they take life a little less seriously. The only iron they've been known to pump is cookie tins and beer cans. They gotta do something to learn how to loop. They tried getting drunk down by the river. They tried New Age religion, but they still couldn't land one. Nothing works until they get their creative tubular training on Peter Boyd's latest invention, the water tramp. get a job take this for example man we could do this we could make bucks here hustling the tourists or something come on let's check it out who knows what's up man come on. Let's try that. Get to you. Right here you go hi hey man just, ah! just Whoa. Damn TV. cool <laughs>
At least we got a roof over our head, you know? <laughs> oh, freaking hell. My, who am I? Who am I? Mama? Mama? Is that you? I can't see anything. I can't. Healed, healed. I can see the light. I can see the light. We can loop now, Cisco. We can loop now, Josh. We need girls, Cisco. Uh, three more, Josh. Vera. one thing that will ruin a good dream, it's got to be an invasion of nuclear rats. But hey, these guys were sleeping on their turf. And this was Paia's biggest role in the movie since Ben. Go get them, Paia. Holy shit, rats! Choir of angels at the foot of my bed. Not sleeping, not resting, but the morning. 
Oh, man, what are you doing? Man, fix your board outside. Don't fix it in here. No way, man. It's too wet out there. I'm gonna fix it. Gotta make it hot. So tomorrow it's gonna be ready for sale. Oh, man. Yeah. Oh. Move. Ah, oh, don't worry. <laughs> uh, Cisco, I think you made the resin a little bit too hot. Yeah. Hopefully a fresh coat of paint will never go to the different <laughs> <laughs> Look at this car! It's a freaking twin! Yeah, man, so a double. Double mm -hmm. travel. Hey, on. Hey, guys. Uh, vous en français? Uh, yes. No. Oh, wait, wait. This, this, this comes from a little bit of sign language. Okay. Me and you get together. Your together. friend, you know, we all get together. No, that's trying to say. Hey Mark! Get over here! Give us a hand with these two! Yeah, man. Okay. Yeah, I used to have a French girlfriend. French is a bit rusty, but uh... What's happening, girl? Um... On a cassé dans notre voiture, on nous a pris notre argent. Um... Nos papiers, on a pas d'endroit où rester. What are they saying, Mark? What are they saying? Come on, go on, tell it. Well, it seems someone's broken their hearts. They have lots of money. They want to take you guys to the fish bucket for lunch, and uh, they're really excited and they want to stay with you forever. Oh, oh, man. Man. oh, oh. Good luck. Jeez. You say it, bro. Good luck. Cool. Guys. Let's let's go. Let's go. Yeah. Let's go, yeah. We'll take our car. Damn, it's a good thing they're paying for this because I don't have a dime. Don't worry, man. We are forward. Well, should we say our blessings? Yes. Thank you, God, for the perfect food, with the perfect hairs, with the perfect legs, with the perfect leaves. Ah. Hey, don't forget the perfect champagne glass breasts. Yes. The perfect bed and the perfect headboard. Yeah. Yeah. Ah. Oh, mais tu I love the way the bar shines on the The butter shines on her lips, yeah. It's the tartar sauce that does it for me. <laughs> I'm not sure I can take this any longer. What? What did you say? Hey! Don't you, don't you, don't you, don't you be putting your finger towards me. Oh, man, like a Take that! Oh, Jesus! Hey, what about the tank? Hey, we should do this every night! This is a riot! Hey, it's just like the birds, man! Don't fight it, it's a riot!
are for slugs, crackers for bugs. Yo, just say no, no, no. Hey, score, man. Hey, man, why are you picking in the couches? Shrooms, man. Shrooms? These are magical Maui mushrooms. You should try it, you like it. Just, just say no, man. Just say no. Just say no to that. Wow. Well, students, Cisco, they're just little mushrooms. What more possibly harm could they do to our brains? I don't know, no. man. These must be a really spiritual thing. And hey, don't panic. They're organic. Try going and Haleakala on the homework. It's just try nice in nature. It's just a little mushroom. Yeah, chew them good. They don't taste very good. Why do you eat them? Just keep chewing. Yeah, I didn't come to sing you the blues. Or moan and groan about paying dues. I want to bring you down with any more bad news. I didn't come to sing the blues. I'm singing this song. We are one and are riding the waves out in the sun on an ocean swell with a trade in breeze over the reef riding next to me, yeah. Hey, yeah, yeah. Hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. I love a northwest swell and a Kona breeze blowing rainbows over tall palm trees. Wahine in the waves at their graceful Ladies of the sea in every way. Hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, yeah, yeah, Understand, man. You don't understand. Just look at it. Feel it. No, man. No. No, man. I just can't communicate with you I'm from a different world. Hey, how you guys doing, man? You all right? Yeah. Oh, you're okay. I love it. Oh, man. I think I got sick. Oh, too many shrooms. Bummer, dude.
50 great pickup lines for single men. Man, when you get a wife, you know, it's like you gotta take them to the mall, you gotta take them, you know, to the movies, you gotta take them to so many places. You gotta just, talk to them. You gotta talk, man. I'm like, Jesus, I'm not into that. Just, if you get a good five hour sailing, man, you're fine. You just wanna take a nap, man. Yeah. Yeah. Well, it's kinda like this, though, Cisco. I don't think I could handle like a 10 minute thing with a woman. I think I could use like 10 hours in a wet bed full of hot sticky mangoes. Oh, for like 10 hours of ecstasy. I don't know, it's this. <laughs> right now, oh, hey. I see it. Hey, there we are, man. The French birds. What are you guys sitting here on the beach for? You should be out there sailing. Well, you see, I'm the one with the wind, so now I'm practicing being one with the sand. Oh, uh, yeah. You should be the one with the coconuts. <laughs> Moron. What, <laughs> Ed? Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. interested in us. What on earth ever gave you that idea? Well, in that case, why you didn't give me a sack lunch and send me on my way? She didn't have a sack lunch on her. We're not interested in American guy. I mean, they're fine for 10 minutes. Yeah. Then they always go start talking about football, cars. I'm a genius. <laughs> I don't like football. I, my car doesn't even have an engine. Yeah, and I haven't been late in so long. I don't make it last two minutes. Wait up, Jay. To us, you boy.
right, man. You dial the number. The number is 1-900-SEX-CHICK. Okay, okay, okay. Here we go. Come on, man. Faster. Faster. Dial it. Come on, let's Relax. go. Relax. You haven't even found your own number. Is she there? Center of the Universe, Madam Moonstar here. Madame Moonstar? Give me that, you idiot. You must have called 1-900-PSYCHIC, not sex chick. Um... Yo, Madam Moonstar, if you're so psychic, what do me and my friend here look like? I see not in physical boundaries. I see only cosmic realities. Oh, uh, yeah, so like another 1-900 ripoff number, right? Hawaii, papaya. Whoa, she even knows the way I talk. Ja wind, rust the fry, eye and eye in the sky, peace and harmony, make it to Hukipa. Make, make it, it to Hukipa. Make, make it to Hukipa. Holy shit, we got a live one on the wire. This is the operator. Nine dollars, please. Listen, lady, I'm out of bucks right now, but keep the phone call going and I'll pay you later. You're having an existential angst. A what? In existential angst. Yo, Cisco, what's an existential angst? Yeah, you know, one of those things, who am I, where I'm going in life, what's going to happen to me in the future. Uh, Madam Moonstar, where am I going in life? Who am I and what am I doing with my life and which way will the wind blow me? Um, oh, great powers of the universe. Channel your mighty telepathies through my heavenly hot chakras. Manifest the future destinies of Jazz and Cisco into the atmosphere. Yes, I see you live on Saturday night. I'm Hans. And I'm fun. And we're going, going to, to pump you up. Will we ever make it to the big time? Yeah, the Big shows, big time. Yes, I see you getting very rich, starring in underwear commercials. Hayes World! Hayes World! <laughs> Give it a shake! Jump in the lake! Take a break! Ah, Hayes World! <laughs> I see Payer Rats. And now, I see dark clouds, a body struggling beneath the white water. Now do $18. Yo, yo, hold on, hold on, hold on. We'll pay you later, we'll pay you later. I'm getting some interference here. Jazz, Cisco, Just, I'm leaving you. We'll pay you later, we'll pay I'm you later. I'm leaving you. Oh, we lost it. Man. What about the money you owe me for the car? Oh, yeah, what about speaking of that? Okay, 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 let's make a deal. No, 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 no. no. The first one to do a double forward loop, double or nothing. Okay, okay. Right on. Deal. Yeah. Welcome to the Marui O'Neill Grand Slam of windsurfing here at Ho'okipa Beach Park. Today, wave performance, and later on, we'll have the swimsuit competition. Cisco and Jazz picked one of the biggest contests in the world to try their skills against the greatest. All the pros were there in living color. Flash was in full concentration mode, while Robbie Nash was scanning the horizon for waves big enough to blow doors in the competition. Jazz with a 360 on the face, and he makes it! 
Hey, look at that. Look at that. Yeah. Who is that? Hey, no parking. It was also unfortunate that their heat came after a bean burrito lunch break. And there goes the show with double loop attempt. your eyes from God. I'm from Brazil. She got it from Brazil. You, you're from you're from where? Brazil, Northeast. She's from Brazil. How long are you gonna be here? For one month. One month. So who you came with? It's my husband. Oh you crazy you shit that <laughs> Ever since they set foot on Maui, Cisco and Jazz had bad luck to contend with. They visited the Grand Kahuna, where they were told that they had learned harmony with the ocean, but they were yet to learn their respect for the spirit of the land. They would have to go to the river of the running blood, wrap the tea leaf around the rock, and follow the ancient warrior's trail to the rock of repentance. Ha <laughs> ha! 
I'm a stupid fucking hole. Hey, mercy on me, kahuna, huna, huna, ula, ua, a, a, pele, agali, biaka. Apokalani. Ahaiku. Hole, hole. Apura, ala. Hanu, nu, 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 as luck had it, our boys in blue were discovered on the beach by an agent for the biggest travel agency in Germany, Hawaii Holiday Service. They had the looks, they had the windsurfing talent. Getting a commercial performance out of these guys would be a challenge greater than sailing to keep on a double mast high day. Welcome to the Speckles World, gentlemen. Oh, well, thank you, Aker. Yes! My dream come true! Those folks from Hawaiian Holiday Service sure know how to treat us. Cut! Welcome to the Speckles World, gentlemen. Uh, one minute, Edgar. We're a little bit busy in here. Cut! Edgar, what are you guys doing? Huh? Oh, let him take advantage of this. Just wine. Wine. <laughs> we need one. Just give me five minutes. Give me five minutes and a hot bed of mangoes. That's all I have. We're moving on up to the sky, to the beautiful apartment in the world. <laughs> yes, it doesn't get any better than this child, let me tell ya. <laughs> Paradise! Just like we pictured! Oh, fuck wrong line! It just doesn't get any better than this! After three weeks in a blown budget from a wasteland of trash takes, here's what they came up with. Welcome to Specklesville, gentlemen. Oh, thank you, Edgar. Thank you, Edgar. Those folks at Hawaiian Holiday Service, they sure know how to treat us. My dream come true. How paradise at last. Edgar, I'll have my 4-7, please, with my 8-6 wave board. And I have my, um, five, two. Okay, yeah. Shall we, ladies? Ah, it just doesn't get any better than this, let me tell you, brother. Every time we put the camera away or change the film, Cisco, Jazz, and Flash always lay claim to landing the double. So, while Cisco reverts to perfecting one loop, Jazz and Flash attempt to bust their skulls in two.
can never count on the weather, but you can always depend on the forecast being contrived to please the tourist industry. Aloha Maui. Glen Weatherman James here for a look at Maui's weather today. Good to have you with us on this beautiful Tuesday morning here on Maui. We've got some good strong trade winds coming and our weather buoys that are anchored a couple hundred miles out around the Hawaiian Islands are showing some real good surf coming our way. After several attempts at self-propulsion, C and J give it up and hit the skate palace. At least it was good for a revelation. Wood is not as soft as water. wind service an apology right off the bat. I said yesterday that there'd be some good waves and some good wind coming and I even guaranteed that but uh, we had a low pressure trough move in here and shut down our wind and I think it was a pot of whales out there that got in the way of that swell coming. So today I want to forecast 25 knot winds and I think the swell is going to jump up even a bit more and we're going to have four to six foot waves with some seven foot sets. I'm, I'm just certain about this and so get your equipment, throw it in the car, have a cup of coffee and Hit it. The winds be blowing, so let's get going. New wind surfers, I want to—I I just don't know what to say. I've been promising you a classic day here for the last two days with big winds and big waves, and I've let you down. But today, uh, this is going to be the day of all days. I think this could be the classic day for windsurfing all year long. We've got 25 to 30 knot winds from the northeast, the perfect direction for some good windsurfing, and we've got some six to eight foot northwest swell approaching our windward side right now, and I'd say we're going to have some 10 foot sets. This is the big day. I want to promise you with my life that this is going to be the epic day here on Maui. The whale pods were getting thicker, and so was the weatherman's stack of baloney. There wasn't a swell coming. There was hardly even a ripple. The sun was setting on all hopes for a day of glory. Is this about the weatherman? Yeah. I'm taking my little hang time. Yeah, maybe that'll bring the wind back. Yeah, I'm oh, in the mood for a good wait. lynching. Yes! <laughs> <laughs> Let's get out! Wait, wait, one more park now! No way! Don't you dare! I see you already! Stop! Stop! No, you guys! Wait, stop the wind! I can feel it! I can feel it! This will teach you! This will show you! No! Just in case hanging in the weatherman didn't work, Cisco and Jazz resorted to the more traditional forms of sacrifice on Maui. Red sky at night, sailors delight. Red sky in the morning, sailors warning. As a new high moves north of the island, the trades build in strength, setting up just in time for the biggest contest in the history of windsurfing, the Aloha Classic. This was a mother of all contests. It would be a wet and wild showdown of the best talent in the world.
near the end of the day, Cisco goes for the glory and gets nailed by a big one. He is rescued by Taz, who drags him in on his board as Cisco slips out of consciousness. Something more original. Yeah, just put some sex, some violence, yeah, some drugs, you know. drugs, more blood, more guts. All yeah. that, you know. Yeah. How about a helicopter crashes? The director goes down. The camera. Oh, man. Man. Production is ruined. Nobody believes oh, yeah. it. It's too typical. Yeah, man. It's too out there. Unbelievable. Well, thanks, Tom. In the end, it was decided by committee. Finale would be real. A real good day at the people. Chris, bring an east to west traveling in pan at the steady altitude of 50 feet. Okay, that's good. Try to get a little side angle on Orange Town. Alright, that's a wrap. Hey, it's getting a bit dusty. Let's gain some altitude and head back to the port. Chris, you read me? You read me? Let's head back to the port. Roger. Roger, you read me? Roger, you read me? Roger, you read me? Let's head back to the port. Chris, we need a big gust dripping up the water from the east. Get your tail road around. We're stalling. Officer, Chris, officer. Watch out for that wave. Chris, wave! <laughs> I'd like to thank all the little people who got myself and Cisco here to where we are today. Um, without your help and without the love of the people, we would be nowhere. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> 